Hi everybody, in this video I'll present to you some of the unique hats in Wizard 101 and what qualifies to me as unique would be items that can't be duplicated up to a maximum of 6 wizards. That means one on each account through either questing, rewards, or such promo codes that only allow you on one account. So with that in mind, let's actually jump into it. So for our first hat is the birthday hat and this unique headgear or unique hat was available during the 7th birthday of Wizard 101 and continuing onwards. So if you didn't receive one in the latter half of the Wizard 101 anniversary then you'll probably get one upcoming and during the 10th anniversary. And this hat is no sell and no auction. The second hat we have here would be crowns. Now crowns was actually available through a promo code which Basically, King Zazo promoted through their Twitter handle and KI Live. Luckily for you, this code actually still works, and the code is Triple Crowns. And this item is also no sale, no auction. If you're looking to graduate, the graduation cap has got you covered. Not only can you get the cap, you can also get the entire attire, no pun intended, from the quest Pomp and Circumstance. This quest is only available through the pre-quest Light and Shadow, which requires you to battle Morgan and finish her off. And not surprisingly, you graduate from Ravenwood after you defeat Morgan, which leads you to Polaris. This hat is no auction, no sell, and no trade. If you're looking to stay safe from falling blocks, the next hat is the hard hat. And this was actually available from the quest called Pardon Our Dust, which in terms was available from Renee Wolfton in the commons. However, since she has moved from the commons to Oldly Town with her crew, it is no longer available, which means that it is retired. So if you were looking to get it, you can't get it anymore. This hat is also no sell and no auction. Now this hat is actually one of the best hats in the entire game in the sense that it gives the ultimate protection and the name which it implies which would be the Helm of Ultimate Protection. And it has the best stats in the entire game giving a total of zero bonuses. The hat was available through a promo code called the best hat ever back in 2016. And like the others on the list, it is no sell and no auction. The next hat is the version of the birthday hat. And you probably won't go to a party without this. And that would be the party hat. Now the party hat is pretty unique in the sense that it was before birthday hat's time. Which back in 2010 was available through a code called party pack. The party hat is actually a lot more unique in terms of style than the birthday hat because of the female version being purple and orange color. And like the other hats on this list, it is no sell and no auction. And our last hat to stay cozy during a winter's night would be the silent nightcap. Now the silent nightcap is also unique in the sense that it also has a female version attached to it. And it looks very similar to the Santa hat. Unlike the Santa hat, however, it is a blue colored version of it. This hat was only available through a promo code called SILENT during the months December 2010 and December 2011. It is also worth noting that you could have gotten this as a prize from King's Izo Free Games. Unlike the other hats, however, it is no auction and crowns only, meaning you can sell it. Although I wouldn't know why you want to sell it in the first place. It's pretty unique. That about does it for the unique hats that you could have obtained in this video. If I've missed anything, comment down below. But other than that, I'll see you guys in the next one. And until then, take care of yourselves and peace. This is Wild Turkey Turkey.